What does that mean, connection with yourself? I imagine most of us go through life really actually not feeling connected to ourselves and just not realizing it. Being in connection with you now, like the eye contact and it's like I'm right here, right at the seems like when we're present together, like now, things get more vivid. What they've actually found is the brain actually speeds up in a way, like the connections, they become more efficient when there's this centering and this presence. It gives us the impression that everything's slowed down. So there's something about being in human connection. I find this kind of almost poetic, that just being human beings together actually helps us go into these meditative states. I've come from London. Oxford. I travelled from Italy here just for the festival, really. It's a beautiful space surrounded by nature. Very cool to, to think that I'm in this container of six days with so many people. Good food, good music but also deep practice. It feels like where life happens. So enriching to be in the circle <laughs> and, and just to connect in that mode. I wanted to experience kind of deep connection with people and to, to nourish and rejuvenate myself. I felt the, yeah, the rage and the excitement and the centrality and the sadness and the joyfulness of, of one person <laughs> and like yeah wow how precious that that I, I get to witness that it's quite challenging in life I'm in some kind of like tension or maybe fight or flight response and like I just get used to it and not realizing okay I can actually slow down and be present with people and then I come to a place like this and I get to see all of that. Honesty or truth is actually quite intense. You start to realize that you feel more subtle things than you normally feel or you have these judgments. To just really sense the, like, the impact, how I can learn something in that experience. Yeah, so such a gift there, even if it's a difficult want to receive. It can touch yeah, pain because it feels so good to be close to others. And noticing really the, the humanness of this experience, it's, it's in our face. The more we, we are with people and share it, the more like I feel that, oh yeah, that, that's also me and that's also me and I felt that too. Even this now, it's like, It's intense in my body. And like I feel, it makes me feel really alive. Um, but it's not like casual, easy. It's not like I should be here for people. It's more like, it's a softness to it. It's like, oh, huh. yeah. How am I here? How, how, what's the way that I'm showing up and is there space for others in terms of the kind of a loving warmth that I've experienced in many people here. Everybody has something to, to offer and to, to learn from. When we come together in these transformational connection containers, we can practice this deeper honesty, this revealing what's really true, hearing what's really true for others, but we can do it in an environment where we've learned how to navigate the complexity of it. What I've learned is to not actually expect the same level of intensity you can do in the dojo in the real world, but just having a little bit more each time actually is really nourishing. In this festival, like I've, I've learned to deepen into that trust. And I'm also starting to see it integrate into my life. It's changing my day-to-day -day life like, in quite a, quite a deep way.